six of my favorite silver wigs for 2023. These are six wigs that are in my playlist. If you want a more detail, be sure and go to my playlist to look up the different silver wigs that I'm going to show you today. But I kind of want to start off from it's no particular order, but I will end probably with my favorite that and there's a reason why. And I'm going to show you the each wig, what how the difference are, the different fibers and the different caps and why they're my six favorites. So we're going to start off right off the bat. And this particular one is Real Deal. And Real Deal is an iced sweet cream. So it's kind of a, a platinum with just a bit of sweet yellow in it. And it's not quite silver, but almost. So if you're not wanting to go totally silver, the sweet cream is a really beautiful one to do. Now the sweet cream, this is Raquel Welch, and it does have a stretch open wefting and it has the velvet ear tabs. What's great about it is it's this mono top. This is hand tied on the top. It's got the lace front and has extended tabs and the lace goes all the way into the ear tab to the other ear tab. So really great. And I would say this is more of a medium density so let's go ahead and get this one on to show. And you can see this is what you're going to find when you get a wig out of the box. You haven't worn it in a while. You're going to have to shape it and style it, shake it out, and brush it through. So <clears throat> you can see right off the bat, it's got this very platinum in the front, which is white, which is very much like my own natural platinum hair under there, my bio hair. So get the ear tabs placed right where you want them. And then as you can see, beautiful, fun, short little bob. I really think this is great for somebody that wants to keep it. And all of these are shorter. I like in my silvers and all at daily wear wigs. This is a great, all of these are great go-to, running out the door, going to store, whatever you're doing, winter time to have a scarf on. But as you can see, really pretty, great hairline. So if you're wanting to clip it back for something really kind of cute like that, right? Tuck it behind the ear. It's not a, this is one of the things, it's hand tied up here, right? So you don't have any of the permatease in here. So you can get it really, really lay down if that's what you want for a more low density look. Really fun color, really nice. I think it's very flattering. You're gonna find that I love all of these little bobs and I love the ones that always kind of come down towards my chin line because that's flattering, right? It hides any of the little problems we might have down there right here it's a great shape so this is my first one and this is raquel welch it's called real deal and it's an ice sweet cream and it is heat friendly now this is on the range of i would say mid-range you know price wise like you know it's it's affordable and it has all these nice bells and whistles with the hairline and everything. The more that you have a mono top and the more that you have the lace in front from here to here and hand tight, it's going to be in a higher, a little bit higher range, but still very affordable and you're getting quality. This is Raquel Welch, heat friendly. So if you wanted to bump some more curl into this, you're gonna be able to bump some curl in this. And I'm sorry if I don't mention any pricing in these because it's very possible someone will see this video and they will see it two years from now and the price maybe is different then or maybe it's not around. But just know that that's the reason why I never mention pricing in any of my videos. This is just to give you information Go to the link, go to the website, check it out a little bit further. But this is one of my top six for 2023. So this is the first one, real deal. So let's go ahead and put the next one on. And the next wig that I'm going to show you is Raquel Welch. And it's called 
flirting with fashion. So my hair is going to get kind of as we go along, right? Okay, so this one is flirting with fashion. It's Raquel Welch, and it is more of a silver. See that beautiful silver mix? And it is just silver. This one is just silver. And what's nice about it, you can see that it has that about 5% brown in there. This one makes gray hair. White like this gets really translucent. And that little mix of brown that we once had in there, that's what makes us look gray. Okay, so again, this is open wefting, very similar cap, heat friendly, mono hand tied top, lace front to the ear tabs, velvet ear tabs. So let's go ahead and pop her on. And this is called Flirting with Fashion. So always put, pop my hand in, get it back to my hairline. And I'd say, look at this, a little edgier than the last, right? But the idea of a short kind of shaggy bob and of course I have it over the side, but with that mono part, you could go left, right, or center. But this just does have where you can really get some wig wax in there, have fun with it, and flip these edges out to make it just a little more flirting with fashion, because that's what this is called, flirting with fashion. It's silver and it's heat friendly. So again, you're gonna be able to apply if you wanna get it where you have just some light curl or wave in it, but again, because this is hand tied, it's going to lay down so we can do like that and really groom it down more. Very similar to the last one, but it's just got that little bit of flip that you can make it edgy and flip out or tuck it behind your ears, bringing it forward. Again, remember, I love this tuck under that jawline. I think it is so flattering on us. So again, a nice go-to wig to pop on, scarves, turtlenecks. It's going to be a great wig. Open wefting, so it's going to be also cool. And it's a great little wig. This is Raquel Welch. Again, great price. And with the open wefting, anytime you go with open wefting, the pricing is a little bit better than when you go with a wig. If you're wanting though, that solid cap, lightweight, I'm going to show you some coming up. They do cost a little bit more, but that's because the quality or the, um, the bell and whistle that you're getting in that cap is a little bit higher than just having the open wefting, right? Okay, so we hope you understand that. But this is so awesome. All of these wigs are really great. These are my sixth favorite. My third favorite that I have is Link. This is Ellen Villa. If you don't know, over in the Netherlands and in Germany, a W is pronounced in English like a V. So that's why we say Ellen Villa is because over there we pronounce that W as a V. So I know that gets confusing, but I hope that will help. So this particular this third one is called Link. It's in Snow Mix, which is a pure silver white, very pure silver white, just a lot like my own hair. I want to show you the difference in the caps. In Ellen Villa, this is to show you that this is 100% hand tied. See that cap? It's closed. There's no open wefting in it. See how you can even, when I get my hand in the back there, you can see my fingers. That's how sheer this is. That's how lightweight, you just wouldn't believe if you're touching this, how lightweight it is. So this is where the cost of the wig makes begin to go up a little bit because you're buying and you're getting that closed cap, hand tight, and no permittees. Okay, pull it on the back grab the ear tab and see this is that short pixie so maybe you have long hair you can get your hair up under here but and you've wanted to try a pixie you don't want to commit to the short hair or you're like me and you have really short hair and so this is a way to kind of stay within how you really look in real life right and your bio hair and I think it's a great little wig when you don't want 
to go all the way to longer bob or long, right? This is that great little wig, and this is Link, L-I-N-K, and this also is from Ellen Villa. And it also, these first three are heat friendly, so you could get a little bit of bump or curl, but because this is hand tied with this cap, it's going to be very lightweight, and you could really get that density down, so you can really get in there. But also, guess what? You can bump that hair back, look at that, and get it off your face. And that's a great look. I just love this wig. I love all of these wigs. So it's always hard for me every day to get up and decide which one I'm gonna wear, because these are great silver wigs. So if you're silver and you wanna stay as close to what your bio hair is, this is, great one. It's a pixie. It is a pixie. I know I haven't turned around on all of these wigs, and but guess what? You can go back to the playlist, and I have, I have all of these in the playlist, so you can go back and really see a lot more detail. This is Link Ellen Villa, and isn't she adorable? Look at that hairline. Can, would you be able to tell that's a wig? No, you can't. None of these wigs. You can't tell these are wigs when you're wearing them. No one else can tell either. Look at that. That's amazing. So this is Ellen Villa Link. And the shorter a wig is, the less the cost. So if you're wondering why sometimes a long wig is more fiber, it's more materials to make that hair. So that's why too. Okay, so this was our third one. We have three more to go. My favorite product. I don't know. This might be my favorite to tell you the truth. Okay, so this next one that we're going to do is Femme and Flirty. And, yep, Femme and Flirty. And she is a silver, all of these, you know, rest of the earth, that silver mix. And, oh, sorry, I dropped my card. The Femme and Flirty, this is a synthetic, so no heat on this. And this is called Sugared Silver. And it has that like 5% brown in it and a little it's just gorgeous so very realistic this is feminine flirting and this one is flirty right it's got a more volume than the other ones that you looked at oh sorry let's go back and look at the cap i like to show the cap first this is an open weft right and it has the lace front with the mono part and so just the tiniest bit, this one has a little more permatease just in this crown area, and then you're open wefting. So <clears throat> still very, very lightweight, these wigs are. This one's synthetic, so can't put heat to it. Get those ear tabs in place. But this one is for my silver girls out there that just want a bit more volume to their hair, right? It still has a great hairline. We're going to be able to pull that back or wear it back. Of course, I'm going to go ahead and tuck it over here, pull those little sideburns down. And this is going to be one that, again, going to have a bit more volume. It's got this longer nape. See, it has a great nape, right? I like that. And you're going to be able to, sometimes what you want to do with these is spray some water on it. Wig wax, water, and that's going to help you begin to get to put more style. See if I want it back like that. Just spray some water on it. And then it starts to go back. You can style it that way. So don't be... Don't be shook when you take your wig out of the box and you put it on and you're thinking, that doesn't look the same as me like it did on Mel. Well, the reason why is that I'm playing with it. I get it out. I'm combing it. I'm spritzing water on it. You see what I do here? This is what you're going to need to do too. You're going to need to make it your own and get the style that you want in it. So whether it's a tuck behind the right ear, if you want it coming forward towards your face, then put some water on it, spray some water, 
or wig wax, but I like the water. And see, just like that, how I just totally changed the style to kind of a back. So cute, right? Just makes a difference in that little bit of water and that little bit of styling to get the look that you're happy with. So this is Lim and Ferdy, Thim and Flirty, and this is Sugared Silver, and this is Gabor. All of these wigs you're going to find on wigs.com. Okay. That was number four. We're down to number five. If you're still here, thanks for sticking with me. These are so all exciting for me. I hope that you enjoyed seeing how each one looks because if you're shopping for a wig, this is a great silver wig. This is a great video to watch. This is Select Soft and Silver Mix and it is a Ellen Villa. So Select Soft, Soft from Ellen Villa and Silver Mix. So that meaning it's got white in the front, it's got a darker gray in the back, meaning there's more brown coming into it. And it gets lighter and lighter as it gets to the front, which is a great, great way, a wig to get for a lot of you ladies, because that's how we kind of go gray, right? I'm white up here and it's a bit darker in the back, still has some brown in it. This is an open wefting. This has a mono part and beautiful hair is sewn up underneath the front of the wig to give it a very realistic look. <clears throat> also, Ellen Villa, their wigs tend to be petite to average. So it's gonna fit you somewhere in that range. Always be sure that you're measuring your circumference and ear to ear and go to the website. Wigs.com has all of the wigs, all of the brands and their different measurements. So you'll pick out exactly the right fit. It's real important to do that because you don't want to have it show up the door and then it doesn't fit you properly. Okay, so in this kit, I love the silver mix and see how it's shorter over here on the side. Isn't that cute? With this longer sweep over to the to this side. This is my right side. Really love that. It's a bit edgy. And it's really a lot of fun. And this is again, let me tell you the name of it again. This is Select Soft Silver Mix from Ellen Villa. Look at that. It is soft looking, isn't it? Again, another great pixie. And she's just beautiful. Let's take a look at that front. It has a <clears throat> has the lace from here to here. So this is one that you're going to want to wear. You can push this part up here and then wear the rest of it swept over to the side. Great, right? So which one is your favorite so far? And I'm, I think I change my mind every time I put one. I was like, oh yeah, oh, I love this one. Oh, this is pretty, right? Okay, great. This is called Select Soft. Or is it Soft Select? I've always heard Select Soft. Okay, and then the very last one is one that is kind of is a one I grab every day. Um, not every day, but a lot of times in the morning, this is one I'll, I'll grab and pick. And this is called Star. And Star is also a synthetic. And it's just that silver white in the front goes grayer towards the back. And the cap, and again, is that beautiful hand tied, completely hand tied. This is light as a feather, lace front, lace top, hand tied. It just feels, when you put these on, these particular caps just melt to your head. It seems like it just forms completely and are very comfortable. So, okay, there we go. This one is just a little bit longer bob. And I love this, the hairline. I love the mono, the cap, and I love that fit. I love this bob, the length of it. And I like that I can push it back because that's all from here to here lace. 
but I also like, I trim these, it has bangs, but I guess the way it was fitting on me, I just needed to come in here and trim it right above my glasses, because I do wear glasses, so I like to make sure that these are cut just above where my glasses fall. And I love just that bit of fringe to have a nice fringe look. This is Star, and she is from Ellen Villa. Pure, and it's a pure silver white. Isn't that pretty? So I saved this one to last because sometimes I feel like she's my favorite, but after I've tried these on, they are all my favorite. They're my favorite six from 2023 of my silver wigs. So I hope this helps you if you're shopping and looking for a silver wig. Pick which one you like, go for it, and then get another one. I love having the variety of a pixie to a bob. It's great. And this is very low density. You can't go wrong with a hand tied cap. All of these from the Racco Welches, Ellen Villa, Gabor. Thank you all so much. And Wigs.com for allowing me to review these and share these with all of you. So I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next video. Doing my darlings. Bye.